Hey guys, welcome back to Criminal Content. My name is Amelia, and today we are going to be watching Knives Out. Before we begin, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and click the little bell icon. Uh, I know that this is a mystery movie. We've been kind of on a murder mystery streak here on Criminal Content, and I love murder mysteries. I just, I think they're just so fascinating and intriguing. Um, I recently watched Clue, if you want to head on over there and watch. And um, as usual, the full watch along will be on Patreon. Without further ado, let's get into Knives Out. I always thought the Lionsgate logo was so cool looking. Oh, this also looks like Hell House. With the two dogs. I love that mug. Oh, creepy masks. Oof. Nope. Heebie jeebies. Morning, Mr. Thromby. <laughs> oh. Makes you wonder who they're gonna reveal now. It's Harlan's son. Oh. Hi, Martha. It's Walt. Mm-hmm. Would you mind coming to the house early? Yeah, I'll call her ID. More questions for everybody. What? Questions. You with the help? Hey, her name's Marta. She was Granddad's nurse. She's with us. The help? <laughs> I was gonna say. How are you doing? Not very good. <laughs> Gosh, yeah, I bet. I am Detective Lieutenant Elliot, and this is Trooper Wagner. Now, um, I'm going to... <laughs> this just to make things easier. <sighs> All right, we're with Linda Drysdale, Neat Thromby. Uh, so, mm. we understand that, that night the family had gathered... To... Almost sound a little bit forced. Okay, um, and your son, Ransom. Quite the name. Before? Yes, but he left her. Ransom like Ransom note? Sorry. I built my business from the ground up. Oh, just like your father. You two were very close. We, uh, we had our own secret way of communicating. Mm -hmm. Everyone idolizes their dad, right? I don't know. Do they? Very much not. I was gonna say. They're just like, uh, like I won't spoil it for you, but oh, okay, like Thousand Knives. Oh, Thousand Knives. Knives out. We all got here around eight. Uh, my wife, Donna, she's my rock. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> I sighed to think about our books and what we've accomplished with them. It's like I can still feel his hand on my shoulder. Oh, he's got the cane. And the torch. So we're here with Joni Throm. <gasps> oh my gosh, that thing in the background. That's a bunch of knives. But you remain close to the Throms. Oh, they're my family. <laughs> Supported by them. <laughs> That balance of opposites that's the nugget of flam. Sorry, then. <laughs> oh, yeah, flam, you're so uh, Sorry. I forgive you. I forgive you. My presence will be ornamental. You will find me a respectful, quiet, passive observer. Okay. From Hamilton. Oh, Hamilton. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good. Why did so I not catch it? Public. Oh. Why did I not catch that? I'm a theater kid and I didn't catch that. I'm ashamed of myself. And I'll proceed, but. But wait, Paraguay? Man. Didn't they say she's from Ecuador? But Charlie Walt runs the merchandising, adaptations, the film and television rights. I mean, are you baiting me, detective? And don't call me Shirley. And don't call me Shirley. They're free of it. Oh. Dad, are you firing? I was about to say, did he just fire his son? No, I'm letting you go. My mind's made up. Mm. Ransom, that's uh, Richard and Linda's son. Mm. Look, we all love Ransom. He's a good kid. We love him. So Walt would be angry about getting fired. Could have potentially done it. And I'm not. I'm not. I'm not trying to. I, I like to keep stuff like this in the family. Well, I mean, his name is Ransom. Poor kid probably hates his life. Yeah. I couldn't make it out really, but it was huge. And it's strange. They went into another room. To yeah. So I, now I, I am writing I swear this to God. tuition check. Just money you or Meg will get from me. With the office at the school. So the last money you'll ever get. 
except inheritance. So. What's he looking for? <gasps> huh. Was it a red herring or was there some kind of secret code? See, I might be a victim of my own expectation here, but when the- The glass didn't shatter. My door? I expect it's going to be about something, if not extraordinary, then- Well, I suppose the window is open. But, I'm sorry, this is an open and shut case of suicide, and, um, I mean, the guy practically lives in a clue board. <laughs> but no possible motive for murder. Where are you going? <gasps> oh, God. Fair? Yeah, a yes or no will do. Mm, no. <gasps> Richard is having an affair. His father-in-law found out and confronted him. You all right? Yeah. Even if that were the case. Ooh. Well, that answers that. For the inheritance? Come on, no. Have you seen her Insta? She's an influencer. No, allowance is a motive. Again, more weak sauce. <laughs> but considering how rich he is, yeah, it would be a motive. Harmon yesterday with a news clip and a throb is dead. An envelope, that worked. An envelope of cash. Marta took Harlan upstairs to give him his meds. <clears throat> She's concerned about Harlan, so she goes up to investigate. Waking Linda. Wouldn't the thug have woken her up, though? If she's a light sleeper. Walt, I'm leaving. Walt was smoking a cigar on the porch with his son. He saw her leave and drive off. Based on this, the medical examiner determined the time of death to be between 12.15 and 2 a.m. Meg woke up because the dogs were barking at her side. Used the bathroom, went back to bed. He's the one to cut his own throat, all right? I don't know why we keep going over this. Physical evidence can tell a clear story with a false tongue. Mm. Okay, let's do this nine by nine. Mm. Yeah, I'm playing to build a beautiful pattern. That's elder abuse. ARP. Don't make me get the belt, abuelo. It's basically <laughs> over. My only hope is that an earthquake will strike. Hmm? Uh-oh. Oh. Get under our door frame! Yeah! <laughs> I cut the line on all four of them. <laughs> yeah. Wasn't easy. Mm. I'm sure. I'd like to fix some of this before I go. Close the book with a flourish. I guess we'll see. I guess we will. Oh, something about that phrase. <gasps> oh my God. Oh. This is what I just give you a hundred milligrams of. I messed up. Uh-oh. Excuse me, but, but what is the good stuff's dosage supposed to be? <laughs> Let's not call it that right now, okay? Three milligrams. <gasps> so, so what happens? I'm gonna give you an emergency shot of naloxone so you don't die in ten minutes. Oh, well, no pressure. Oh, jeez. <laughs> you know, this is an interesting and efficient method of murder. He's so nonchalant. Oh, if someone switched the meds on purpose... Do you have an extra stuff? Yes, I'm gonna find it. I have it because it, it comes with the kids. It should be here. It has to be. Is it not? <sighs> it's not? Did someone take it so that she would be easier to blame? Harlan, I need to call stop the ambulance. This, stop this, stop this, There's no time. Have you have to, to listen. I'm calling the family. <laughs> what do you want me to do? Is she gonna set them up? You can. And say goodbye loudly. Walt, I'm leaving. Call attention to the time. God, it's midnight already. If you can. Take the side yard path through the little gate. The dogs will know you. They shouldn't bark. <laughs> to the third floor without being seen. And the only way is to climb the side trellis and come in through the trick hall window. <sighs> Oh, secret entrance. This is crazy. I don't think I can do We need that. to make this so airtight that the average cop will entirely dismiss you as a suspect. Wait, I said... put them on. 
Put them on herself? I was going to say. Come outside and he'll see you. <laughs> Through the closed window. Dad? Dad? <laughs> You've gone from suspect number one. Yeah, but her DNA would be on those clothes. Well, not DNA, but... Like, hair fibers or something. Not Ransom. Drive home. And sometime in the next few days, the police will question you. No. No, no. You... Well, then don't lie. Tell fragments of the truth in this exact order. I gave him pain medication. I left him in his study. What kind of medication did you give him? Since his injury, I've been giving him 100 milligram IV push of Toradol. Did you notice anything strange or off about his demeanor? Sounds about right. Thank you, Miss Cabrera. Well, that worked. <sighs> that poor girl. But the parents have some blame here. Oh, for what? For wanting a better life for their kids? Isn't that what America is? For breaking the law. <sighs> These sound like typical, like, American Thanksgiving arguments. Point at me. Where's Martha? Is she still here? Oh, Martha. God, she sure is. Come on no. over. <gasps> no, 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 no. Do not involve her in this. Oh, my God. No, 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 no. Family is from Uruguay. But you did it right. I mean, what I'm saying is they did it legally. She did it the right way. They said she's from like three different countries now. Sweetheart, don't feel pressured to answer. This is just- Look, They said her mom was undocumented. It's a novel. Yeah, I know. I haven't read it though. Neither have I. <laughs> the medical examiner was ready to rule this a suicide, but Elliot agreed to keep it pending for 48 hours. Tomorrow morning, <laughs> What? My confidant, my eyes and ears. Hey, wait, wait, detective, why me? Yeah, that's a good question. Well, I know I missed something. There's going to be something I missed. But I know you can beat it. No. You have to do what you have to do to no. beat this and win. Heartland, I can't. You can? You have to. You would think the truth would come out of her at some point. I have to get you help. You do as I say, and everything will be just fine. <sighs> Honestly, it's not worth it to put her through that much. It's like at this point, you may as well just tell the truth. Oh, the blood spy. Well, of course you can. I recorded it SSLP. There's eight hours in that tape. 9 p.m. to 5 a.m. That's an old tape player. <laughs> You're gonna die in seven days. Name that reference. The party ended. What happened? Get down or else it'll reject. Uh, that thing he oh, jeez. Mmm, the magnets? No, model. See them. Stay on that side. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> this character is a dog. I can't buy the puppy. I've never been to a will reading. Oh, uh, you think it'd be like a game show, but think of a community theater production of a tax return. <laughs> I'm trying to think of that. I can't. Suspicious or out of the ordinary. You know, like a dog carrying whatever that is. Sweet beans. <laughs> Ransom? No one knows how old she is. It's your medical bag. She was the one who found him, but it's like, if she lies, she throws up. It makes me think of Pinocchio. But also physics. If it fell hard, it would have clattered really loud. I'm Lieutenant Elliot. I just want to ask a few questions. Sir? 
We're officers of the law. What a douche canoe. Talking and distraught. And distraught. You wanna ask this guy some questions? Hi, right, what is this? What's this arrangement? Mr. Drysdale. CSI KFC? <laughs> Hold on, Mr. Big Shot. How's the SJW degree coming? Trust fund prick. All right. Yeah, honestly. Guys, uh -huh. just... Walt, he was in the bathroom. Yeah, he was in the bathroom. Joylessly <laughs> masturbating to pictures of dead deer. Uh. Oh, you know what, Richard? You want to go? You bet, Skippy, let's go. You want to go? Come on. Oh, hey. you want to go? I think it means our father finally came to his senses and cut this worthless little brat out of his will. Son. Father. <laughs> did Harlan tell you he was going to cut you out of the will? He should. Yep. Maybe this might finally make you grow up. Mm. Asshole. I'm warning you. Ransom said I'm warning. What's the puppy got? Oh, well, you have ransom in there. Oh, That's yeah. the kind of thing he says. Oh, puppy brought something, but she wants the ball, or he. Yeah. I was asking that before. What is that? <clears throat> oh, from the. Well, that doesn't make sense. My entire ownership of Blood Like Wine Publishing, I leave in its entirety to Marta Cabrera. The copyright of its catalog, its entirety to Marta Cabrera. Why are you smiling? Oh. Oh. Uh, no. No. <laughs> they all thought they were going to get something. Why is he laughing? Sorry. Uh, likewise, the house at Two Dearborn Drive and all belongings therein, I leave to Marta Cooper. <sighs> oh, you little... <sighs> In the meantime, I've been in the room. Oh. I think this could be the best thing to happen to all of you. <gasps> Plot twist. You look like you're gonna pass out. Have you eaten anything today? Eat. Turns out the rest of the family was completely greedy. Maybe you and I were the only two who knew him, so you're not gonna bullshit me on this because two, I know Ryan makes you puke. So, look me in the eye. Open <gasps> uh -huh. to my grandfather. Oh. Sure. Marta. <laughs> Testamentary capacity. What about undue influence? Yeah, undue influence. How about that? Did you just Google that? <laughs> That being cut the salami. What about the Slayer rule? I did just Google that. <laughs> Obviously, it doesn't apply here. What is the Slayer rule? What the hell is the Slayer rule? Yeah, exactly. You're full of shit. I don't trust this guy in the tweed suit. And Alan, God bless you. You're useless. Thank you. <laughs> now you beat him and go more than I do, and I thought. What a strange thing to tell me. That is kind of a strange thing. This is what Granddad wanted for you. I mean, think about what he did to go through with this. He wanted this for himself. He wanted this for the family. What's going on? This isn't you. You could use her. This is him after several beers, or maybe it really is him. Okay, yeah. I, I can believe that. I can believe he would say that. Happy ending. Everybody wins. You, me, Harlan. Yeah. <laughs> Deal? But Harlan said, I'm not giving a cent to you, so that's not what he wanted. I think you should give that to us. <sighs> oh no. He is, he's got nothing. Hey, relax. But the truth always comes out sooner or later. Get your ass off. What the hell is happening? There's a guy here and a bunch of stuff. Everything's going crazy. Are we rich? <laughs> what? <laughs> At least I don't know. I don't even know what that means, but you better get your ass off, okay? <gasps> dale, dale, levanta. Oh, that just gave me so much anxiety. Following arcs like lobbed rocks, the inevitability of truth, but the complexity in the gray. I feel like something eventually is going to come out of her. Do with the truth once you have it. She's going to have something to say. 
scrutiny that entails, <laughs> I'd be afraid that could come to light. And that's True. what we want to avoid here. We can protect you. Why do you keep coming so close to her like that? Yeah, 12.09 Columbus Road, 10 a.m. <sighs> totally in the clue. Oh, no. He's... Did you hear me? Yeah, she heard you, but he sees her. Okay, baby driver. Oh, God. You regret helping me yet? I regret not taking the beamer. <laughs> I think she knows what she's doing now. <gasps> Skirt! Pat him down. Check him out. What's going on? Ransom came back, she said. <gasps> I don't know what he came back to do, but we'll find out. But, like, can you trust anything she says? Thank you. Hey, you don't Did need to thank He ask you to drive when he saw me coming. <laughs> Oh. Nope, nope. Totally didn't throw up. Totally didn't throw up. Police station. A case with a hole in <laughs> Listen, I don't know what you want. They're in a laundromat? Whatever it is, we can work it out. But we have to figure it out right here, right now. And I'm leaving with that report. Who is sitting there? <gasps> it's a, I'll help you. I take that back. Listen, this is over. People are getting hurt. So I'm gonna tell you the truth. <gasps> Just told Lieutenant Elliot everything. Oh? She basically told me where it was. And I just handed it to you. God, you're not much of a detective, are you? <laughs> Perhaps we just love each other. Oh, the pressure. I... Excuse me! <laughs> Even the dog with the ball in its mouth? Steal back a fortune that you lost and she deserves! You're a pack of vultures at the feast! Knives out, beaks bloody! Roll credits! Miss Cabrera has decided, definitively, not to renounce the inheritance. <laughs> what? Harlan Thromby is ruled as suicide! And the case is closed. Monk. What? Thank you all for coming. <laughs> Wait. That's certainly not what I was <sighs> expecting. <laughs> is anybody else confused? No. I mean, yes has a hole in it, Senna. It is not a donut hole, but a smaller donut with its own hole. Okay, I'm confused now. Mr. Hugh Ransom Drysdale, you might tell us all why you hired me. That is actually a very good question. You're right. Let's back it up to the night of the party. <gasps> Your argument with Hawk. Mm-hmm. With the overheard words by the Nazi child, masturbate. <laughs> oh, jeez. Harlan told him that I could beat him at go. And I asked myself, <laughs> how would the topic of the will have steered around to murder? Yeah. His explanation. You can't be that crazy. You're not just going to throw away your fortune. No, I'm giving it to Marta. <laughs> All of it. <laughs> you use the syringes in the kit to switch the liquids and the two medication vials. And as a final precaution. Naloxone, the life-saving antidote. Hand me that vial of morphine. I'll show you. I accidentally switched them back, so I gave Harlan... The correct dose. <gasps> yes. <laughs> but not accidentally. You knew because there is the slightest, almost imperceptible differences of tension and viscosity between... 
He'd done it a hundred times. <sighs> you gave him the correct medication because you are a good nurse. Oh. And Harlan was... I'm sorry, Marta. But yes, Harlan was perfectly fine. His blood was normal. <sighs> he would be alive today. <sighs> Damn. <sighs> Are you back again already? Are you back again already? Because earlier that night... Marissa, you're back. <laughs> Come on, Marta. This is stupid with two O's. <laughs> with your permission, I'd like to spin a little further. Much later <laughs> that night, you'd have to come back to the house to retrieve the incriminating tent. Uh -huh. Now, the circumstances are perfect for the anonymous hiring of me. Oh. Leave the vows. You must wait for your moment when the investigation is over and you... <gasps> uh. That is why. You miss the funeral. <gasps> there is no one home to wonder why you're going into Harlan's study. <gasps> oh. Spirits ready to see the family tear itself apart. Okay, yeah. Knowledge, it will be all undone when the talk. He definitely wanted that. James Will is gonna stand. He has lost. Huh. Unless. <gasps> In for a pound. In for a pound. You decide you are in. <sighs> Evidence of martyr innocence. <sighs> the anonymous email with the late morning rendezvous time. Oh no. Oh uh, no. Oh. I don't take that back. Ransom is a con artist. She's okay. <sighs> and then you'll see just how much hell I can wreak on your <gasps> little. <laughs> oh, oh. <coughs> that means she's lying. Yeah, yeah, man, we know. That's right. <sighs> Friend's dead. <gasps> that mean he's. No. Oh my god. I knew that thing with the knives was gonna be a problem. No. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Please, no. No. Let Marta be okay. Let Marta be okay. Let Marta be okay. Where'd that knife- where did that knife go? Where did that knife go? It's a prop! <laughs> right? I hate that for Fran, though. We gotta get the attorney on the phone right now! No, you don't. I want you to remember something. That's right, the blood stain. Not by playing the game Harlan's way. But your <gasps> I was gonna say, playing the game your way. This family. <sighs> They're all greedy. No, they treated you like shit, girlfriend. Help yourself. But I have a feeling you're- You've done enough. <laughs> Ransom. What an ironic name. <laughs> Just take a drag of the cigarette. <sighs> Drinking out of his mug. That was good. That was good. Wow.
I'm blown away. Incredible. I want to see this cast list real quick. I'm speechless. I may have a new favorite murder mystery movie. Daniel Craig. Okay, I knew he looked familiar. Chris Evans, yep. Jamie Lee, always an icon. I knew, I thought I recognized Michael Shannon. Yep, Catherine Langford. And Christopher Plummer. Fun fact, when my mom had her baby shower before she had me, Christopher Plummer was at the same venue. He wasn't at the baby shower, but her friend saw him there. So, fun little fact. <sighs> Anyway, guys, this, that is a wrap on another criminal content. I really enjoyed this one. Ugh, just so incredible. And there will definitely be more murder mysteries in the future with you guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and click the little bell icon for the notifications, and we will catch you next time. Bye!